my channel. My name is Destiny. As you can see from the title today, I am going to be dyeing my hair red or attempting to anyways without using any bleach. Just a couple products I got from Sally's. Uh, right now I got this crusty brown. So yeah, if you try and see how this turns out, stay tuned so you can get your dose of death. All right, y'all, so we're gonna go ahead and get started. I'm gonna show y'all everything that I have first before I go ahead and start the dyeing process. So I have the L'Oreal High Color, damn. I got the L'Oreal High Color Highlights. I got two red and two magenta. It is for dark hair only. And I've watched a ton of videos and the girls have had great results, so yeah. And I also got some 40 developer, um, I got this little bowl and spoon. Uh, I got this conditioner for afterwards that I'm gonna leave in. Got some aquaphor to go around my room because I'm not trying to have red all over my scalp. Got some disposable gloves. I wish I knew. There you go. Got some disposable gloves, some scissors, brush it and comb. So yeah. Oh. And I got some clips too, because as y'all can see, your girl got a lot of hair. So got some clips to separate my hair. But um, yeah, I'm super, super excited to see how this turns out. I haven't had red hair in like four years. So yeah, on the box for these, it says to mix about 2.4 fluid ounces of developer. I got four of them and I have eight ounces. So it's not off by that much. We gotta find out. So I'm gonna just open these up and squeeze all of the colors into this bowl. Now, I heard people saying it was hard to get into these and I'm not about to sit here and struggle. So of course you're supposed to open at the top, but I'm gonna cut right here and just squeeze down that way instead of trying to get it, I'm not doing all that. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and open these up so we can get them. So we can get the process started, whatever. So I'm just, this is way easier. I don't know why y'all wasn't thinking that. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get that all squeezed out. I'm gonna do all four and mix them together. And then I'm gonna show y'all how it looks before I put the developer in. I'm about to put my gloves on right now because really I'm not trying to have red everywhere. That's just not a vibe. And I also laid down one of our cleaning towels because I got this nice ass white vanity and I'm not trying to have uh, red stains all over it. So just laid that towel down. And I got these 10 pack, this 10 pack of gloves from Walmart for a dollar. We ain't got no Dollar Tree out here, y'all. So yeah, I get what I get. All right, y'all, so I finished squeezing the colors in. That's four packs, two red, two magenta. And I'm going to put the whole bottle of developer in because it's only eight ounces. It's supposed to be 2.4 per container. So I'm going to go ahead and pour all of this developer into the mixture. I didn't put all of it, but I'm gonna go ahead and get this all mixed up. I dropped some, so I'm not about to show y'all. Okay guys, so I finished mixing it up and I, it's getting red everywhere. So I finished mixing it up and I'm gonna go ahead and put the Vaseline around the perimeter of my head and straight down and then I'm gonna separate my hair into four parts so I can go ahead and get started. So I only had baby aquaphor, it's my son's, <laughs> but you know, it should all do the same thing. And I'm doing this on dirty hair, y'all. Um, I just took out my box braids and I didn't want to wash my hair because the dye is already going to strip to some and I didn't want it to get stripped again from me 
washing my hair. So I'm just putting this Vaseline, this Aquaphor all around my head. And I think I already told y'all, but I'm doing this so that it does not be staining me up all red all over. And I've already combed, well brushed my hair out to kind of detangle it. That way I can make sure that the color is getting all over. And I'm gonna apologize in advance if y'all be hearing my son throughout this video because I do have the door open today. Cause their dad's not home, so got mommy duties. So yeah, I went ahead and my daughter's right here trying to be nosy, record me with her little iPod. But I went ahead and got myself all oiled up and I'm gonna section my hair off into four parts. And I'm gonna use these little clips right here. My son is coming in here, so it might get a little loud, y'all. And I apologize in advance. All right, so I went ahead and sectioned my hair off. I'm gonna be starting with this side, so obviously I didn't put it up. But yeah, so we're about to get this show on the road, okay? And I'm not a professional, y'all. I've dyed my hair a lot before. And it's always messy, but it's always cute, okay? So I'm gonna just be slapping this on my hair, working it all the way through, making sure that I get color on every single strand, okay? And I just put on this little white beater or whatever they call it because I didn't wanna get my good shirts dirty. So yeah, got my gloves on and really I'm just gonna like dig right in because time to be using that brush and all that all right y'all so i finished putting the dye all over as you can see your girl is messy whatever but yeah i'm gonna leave this on for about 20 minutes i'm gonna put a shower cap on and then i'm gonna come back and show y'all before i rinse it out with cold water okay uh, so it's almost about to be that 20 minute mark so i'm gonna go ahead and oh my god y'all <laughs> all right so yeah I'm about to go rinse this out in the shower. <laughs> it's really bright and hopefully it's a vibe because I don't have time because I will dye my hair back. But I'm gonna go rinse my hair out with cool water upstairs. It's so bright. Hopefully it's a vibe because I don't know yet y'all. But I'm gonna come back and show y'all what it looks like once I rinse my hair. All right, so as y'all can see, I just finished washing my hair. You see the red already. So here is the result. And honestly, super cute. I didn't want it to be a bright ass red. Now it's brighter in person than it looks right here on the camera. Of course, I'm gonna attach pictures for y'all and everything, but I'm going to go ahead and put my deep conditioner on. I'm gonna let that sit for a little bit and then I'm gonna style my hair and come back and show y'all the finished look. But yeah, it's it's super cute. It's like a magenta, right? <laughs> a red and magenta, good mix. So yeah, I'll be back to show y'all the final results and everything in a few. Is the final look. It is giving me more magenta vibes than red, but honestly that's cool because I did not want anything that was way too bright giving me clown vibes and shit. So yeah, this is cute. I'm gonna go outside so y'all can see how it looks in the direct sunlight. And I'm gonna take a couple videos and pictures for you so you can see. But yeah, this is the final look and I really do like it. Um, just to let you know, you will not, well, you probably will not need all four bottles. I probably had like a bottle left inside of the bowl when I was finished and I got a lot of hair. So just take note of that. You probably only wanna get three, um, two if you really don't got a lot of hair for real for real because them things was eight dollars okay but yeah super cute um i had to move my tripod so i could get a full body disregard the white space around me i know it look a little ratchet but it's cool if you guys found this video helpful make sure you like comment subscribe share it tell a friend tell a friend thank you guys and i'll see you next time
all right y'all so this is how it looks outside it's actually not that sunny out here let me see all right but yeah it's super bright it's red magenta vibes whatever but i like it Just...